All right. right. There's the sun. It's, yep. A really cool little area here. Overlook and just a nice barrens. In fact, I was telling Michelle, I said, I found our place to lay out in the sun, you know, this summer. Because I bet no one will be here. I guess until you watch this. <laughs> but kind of cool overlook. See the the forest down below. The only problem is you can hear the interstate clear. But yeah, there's too many nice, cool spots around here to, you know, if you can't handle the interstate, then you're missing out. <laughs> bulge hole and all that. Yep, pretty pretty neat. Pretty neat, I do say. Well, howdy folks. Sean here, Michelle. We're doing some off-site explorer exploring. That's weird. I don't know. <laughs> We're doing some off-trail exploration, <laughs> and uh, we went to a trail recently called the Interstate Trail, and had some bluffage, and the bluffage crosses the interstate and comes onto the side where bulge hole area is so that's what we're kind of on our way to go see just to see what it looks like over here because it was pretty neat over there even if it was just a little bit so that's what we're doing found some more trees out here with tags on them 434 434 kind of strange <clears throat> Got some Paps Blue Ribbon here, Pool Tab Edition. Look at that PBR can. All right, folks, found this neat little, it's like shelter in the rock. Pretty. Goes pretty deep in there. Yeah, it's just like a little, little shelter, a little hidey hole for a squirrel or something. It's a, a plot, and, plot and squirrel. And now we're kind of up top on the bluffage here, hidden, making our way through. See what we can't find or see or whatever in this craziness. This is a really interesting spot because there's like a circular hole right here. So, I'm imagining water pooled in here over time caused the erosion many, many moons ago. But here's that tree that's kind of bent. I thought that was a really artistic. All right, folks. Kind of a real life natural chair. Here, I'll show you. <laughs> Michelle's going to take the camera here away. <laughs> man oh man it was a long hike today i just want to take a breather and sit down and enjoy nature all right folks power line cut out and here's the bluffage at the power line cut out and then that's just like ugh. That's briar heaven over there. So, we're... all right, folks. Michelle found a pretty cool spot, and she's like, "I want to go down," and I'm glad we're we've went down because it's almost like a little cave over here. Haven't got around to it yet. Oh yeah, it's kind of neat. We can get to it. Yeah, it's like a little cave. These trees just don't want me to wear a hat. Uh, 
Michelle found a little little bluffage city up here with little holes and and banding and just all sorts of fun places for the squirrels to hang out. <laughs> well, that's pretty cool. This little cave thing. And it doesn't go far back, you know, about six feet back. But it'd keep you out of the uh the weather and uh the cool thing is right there where michelle is is a waterfall so it just go down so you could be sitting here enjoying a bite to eat after a long hike and watching a waterfall you know or just coming out here in the peace and quiet aside from the interstate noise you know but that's <laughs> that's just something you tune out more cool like barren bluffage um, it's a really really neat little place I think and we've reached the point to where they've fenced it up to protect the interstate or to keep probably try to keep critters and stuff from Getting onto the interstate. It's kind of weird. You don't really think it's ever out there, you know? But it's there. Check out this cool bit of nature. As you can see, it bent and it just kept growing. Check that out, folks. All the mushrooms. Pretty cool. <laughs> All right, folks. We've come across another well, old home site on my 1935 overlay map for Gaia. Um, I could tell there we were close to a an old uh, home site um, once I started seeing these, these bigger trees, which are you can kind of see them, you can spot them, especially that one right there. And uh, yeah, so there's a little bit of rock around here, here and there, um, that was probably used for the, uh, the home. Hmm? Do you need to write a note? Nope, you found an ink pen? Yep. All right, folks. Walking back to the truck. All in all, we've hiked about 1.3 miles. Pretty good. And Found some pretty neat stuff, I think. Oh yeah. The bluffage, the, the little cave shelter thing, and the, I like finding homestead, even if it's just a couple of wells. Must go back when it's raining. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah, definitely. And uh, it was a fun little adventure. So <laughs> please like, comment, share, subscribe, all that good stuff. And until next time, Michelle, I'll see you on the trail. Bit. <laughs> what? She's been letting out some pretty gnarly farts here. <laughs> that is you. It's me. All <laughs> you.